the shooting guard position, six feet four inches, number nine, Kaysen Wallace. At power four, standing six feet eight inches, number 30, Keegan Murray. Starting at center, six feet ten inches. Number three, A.D. Anthony Davis. The other forward at six foot nine inches. Number thirty-five, Brandon Miller. Starting at the other guard. Standing six feet, eight inches, number four, MP. Hi everybody, time to get into it. NBA action on 2K Sports. Our game tonight featuring the Los Angeles Lakers as they go up against the Chicago Bulls. Brian Anderson here. With me tonight are analysts Richard Jefferson and Grant Hill and our reporter, Allie LaForce. for the Bulls. We've got Scoot Henderson and it's Whitehead in a shooting guard. And Lakers. Miller is out there with Murray. Then there's Davis. Then it's MP. And it's Wallace in at the shooting guard position. And it's going to be the Bulls off the tip. Well, if you look at the standings for teams that are on the cusp, the playoffs have already begun, Richard. Absolutely every game counts for those teams. If you don't do your business early, you're going to have to be under a lot of stress late. And that's what's going on. The play-in system, though, that's has created so much First, Keeping the pressure on that defense and MP is just Lakers. unrelenting. MP two shots. Shoot two. And he makes a first. Yeah, what you like about MP is how hard he worked to put himself in a position for success. And Cobb drops them both. For a star like him, you get lots of opportunities at the line, and he's great at cashing them in. Nance outside. Pass to Henderson from behind the arc. No luck on that one. And here are the Lakers. Inside. Oh, it's stolen. And now the Bulls in transition. And that one is ever home. Adding Henderson. insult to injury with the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. <laughs> Once he broke away, you knew what was on his mind. Now here's Cobb. Against Minnesota, he was really on his game. Can't cash it in from close range. Give the defender credit. Willing to challenge the shot. Lots of other guys just let them score there. Down low. Here's Henderson. Rebounded by the Lakers. Not exactly what they're looking for out of the gates. Just one of four shooting. Here's Cobb. 
Nance pulls down the board. I thought he had that all sewn up, but somehow the defense just threw him off. Miller pulls it in. Just haven't found their offensive footing yet, only managing to sink one of their first five shots. MP, the pass to Wallace. Back to MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Giving the people exactly what they want. MP with an attack on the rim. Henderson scanning the floor. They set the pick. Pass to Strother. Nance with it. Five on the clock. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Goes up on the wing, and the shot goes. He just makes it look so easy on offense. It's like, who takes pleasure in torturing defenses? He does. Now here's Cobb. To the middle. It's stolen by Nance. All by himself. Here's Strother. Finished off the break. Strother's got his second basket of the game. Transition basketball. The most reliable way to generate easy looks. Yeah, when you hustle on the break like he does, good things tend to happen. Now here's MP. It's good. Cobb's got six. Man, you watch MP. He is so talented. And this man, man, let me just tell you, he's determined. Henderson against MP. Henderson, the pass to Whitehead. Six on the shot clock. That's the screen. Fires the three. Whitehead, shot is good. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. MP looking around. Outside Davis. Back to MP. Out to the right wing. Here's Miller. MP inside. Defended by Henderson. Another shot. And it's Cobb getting it to go. Give him eight points now. I just love his approach coming into tonight. Focused and aggressive. Henderson against MP. Pass to Strother. Back to Henderson. From downtown. The rebound by Murray. This is hard to watch. You might want to put the kids to bed. This man still has not hit a shot this quarter. <laughs> I tell you, a little extra pressure on D when you're up against a point guard who can elevate. Ha, it doesn't make it easy, does it? Yeah, hard to strategize for a guy who can make a pass or a play like this right in your face. And here are the Bulls now. Following the score by the Lakers. Henderson misses. You know, some people could say he's struggling on offense this period. I like to think it's more of drowning. Just can't seem to find his confidence. Here's Miller. Still no points. If he's doubled, pass to Wallace. Fires for three. Chicago grabs the miss. Their last game, a win against the Clippers. Looking to carry it into this one. And as a rule of thumb, the road can really test your team's depth. But they all stepped up and collectively produced a lot of points. The bench production was huge, no doubt. A testament to how well prepared this coaching staff is for these tough road games. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Well, that was clearly a foul. And the first one at the line is good. At the line, for the Lakers. Wallace. He's perfect from the line this time. And so Henderson will bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. Lakers. They trail by one. And the foul MP. called on MP. That's, That's his first foul first of the game. Foul. First team foul. Henderson against MP. Henderson outside. Fires from the wing. And to put things simply, this has not been his quarter. 
You know, Richard, if anyone had exceeded the hype of the first overall pick, it might be AD. All right, listen. At the end of the day, I think Anthony Davis has met expectations of his own and probably won. A nice yeah. shot by MP. Cobb's got 12 points in the game. Chicago has gone one for five from three-point range. A cold start. Henderson against MP. And that one good. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Davis, the pass to MP. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. That's on Scoot Henderson. That's a shrewd move by MP getting inside and drawing the whistle on the shot. That one's no good. For Chicago, they've gone 6 of 13 so far in this one. Henderson, the pass to Nance. Here's Whitehead. And that one makes him 2 for 2. He's in his rhythm. Nice ball movement there. That's how you break down the defense. For Los Angeles, they've gone 5 of 9 from the floor. MP, the pass to Wallace. Back to MP. Nice assist and nice finish. Solid play all the way around. He's got 15. This quarter has been all his. I suggest they keep the ball in his hands. Pass to Whitehead. Intercepted. MP right side. Nice D from Henderson. The Bulls have gone 7 of 14 and looking in control. They set a pick. And it's blocked by Davis. You can't take that shot in for Davis. His reach is high. Come on, man. That was never going to happen. McDaniels is checked in for the Lakers. And a change for the Bulls. Ball's checked in. Here's Whitehead. Really played well against the Clippers in his last game. Shot clock at two. That gives him the lead. And the Bulls lead by one. Already five lead changes here. Speaks to how evenly matched these teams have been thus far. Ball against MP. Outside Davis. Hey, from beyond the arc. Rebound by the Bulls. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Here's the pick. Ball with it. Checked by Murray. The rebound by Murray. Well, the Lakers shooting a solid 50% in the opening quarter. To the inside. It's stolen by Nance. Ball against MP. Now here's Ball. He's averaging more than 12 a game. A consistent threat on offense. Davis against Nance. Whitehead. No good with the triple. The Lakers trail. Murray passes to MP. The floater. Ball with the rebound. Well, Chicago shooting 44% to start this ballgame. Up top, Nance. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's going to be on Anthony Davis. Second a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for Chicago. The ball movement has been outstanding so far. They've come out of the gate looking for that extra pass. And not only that, you like how they're turning defense into offense, forcing turnovers and capitalizing. Only four games left of the regular season. Let's see how the West is shaping up. Taking a look at the Lakers. A fantastic season so far for them. First place in the conference. I think for Los Angeles, you have to really give it to them. I mean, they are backing up all the preseason hype. They've been outstanding early. And you want to talk about hitting the ground running? They've done exactly this. And you've got to give a lot of credit to their coaching staff for getting this team locked in early. Inside. Outside for Mitchell. There's Ball with a three. Vassell with the rebound. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 3 from downtown. MP against Mitchell. 
Chicago foul. No. And we have to take another look at that block. What a powerful injection. He's not wanting them to get an advantage in this competitive game. Mitchell against MP. They double up Cobb. Four on the clock. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. He was all alone on that one. Nice feed by MP. A popular guy in this locker room. Chicago leading. Pass to Strother. Nance with a screen on McDaniels. 11 feet out. The shot is good by Nance. Saw the angles and led him right to the hoop with that pass. The Lakers have got 7 of 15 to find the net. MP against Mitchell. Shot from 16. And there's two. Work on the glass, paying off that time. Great recognition of the mismatch, abusing the smaller defender, Portugal. Nance outside. Ball outside. Takes a three. Rebounded by the Lakers. MP right side. Pass to Vassell. Back to MP. Oh, it's stolen by Mitchell. In transition, here they come. Low. That one falls. Nice set up by Mitchell. And the Bulls lead by four. We talk about the importance of shooting quietly in rhythm. He feels confident doing this one. Yeah, former NBA teammate Tyrese Halliburton, actually part of how that nickname came to be. Mitchell beat Halliburton in both matchups in college, and Ty gave him credit for causing him to have a couple of On the court for Chicago, they've got Griffin, and it's Nance in at the four-man position. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Ali LaForce. Well, Devin Vassell's game is more varied than he's given credit for. He said, quote, when I first got drafted, 3 and D was the label, but I'm more than that. I excel at all three levels, but people throw labels around, and it's fine with me. At the end of the day, I just try and hoop and prove people wrong, right? That's all it takes. He's a man on a mission. Thanks, Allie. Pass to Murray. Here's Miller. Shoots a fadeaway. Rebound by the Bulls. Nance has got four rebounds now. Whitehead passes to Griffin. And Grant is someone whose career spanned eras. You feel playing defense is more difficult than it was two decades ago. Oh, B.A., it's much more difficult. In part, because the contact allowed is much more strict. Shooters can create contact and be rewarded with free throws, and the skill level on offense has truly raised. It makes it tough for the defender to really get down and play that tough nose defense. McDaniels is checked in for the Lakers. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. And a look at the stats for MP. He hasn't been as sharp as we're used to seeing in the last the 10 games. You can tell in his passing, his assists are down. Even the simple passes look hard for him. Maybe he can get his groove back tonight. The Bulls making a switch here. Nance is checked in, and Cobb drops them both. And so here is Chicago. Ball passes to Whitehead. Back to Ball. And the foul on Anthony Davis. That's his third foul of the game. And that's the risk you run when you leave him in with two fouls. The Lakers making a switch here. Vassell's checked in. Into the lineup for your Lakers. Number Here's Ball. He's got it. Three for seven now. He was inside his own head in that first quarter. You can see it. Now he's doing a much better job of letting the game come to him. Pass to MP. MP with a step and the finish MP. by Cobb. Yeah, MP races in and goes straight up catching the defense. Man, they were not focused. MP 
against Ball. And the foul called on MP. That's foul number two for him. That's his That's second, his second foul here pretty foul. early in this one. He's got to be careful for the rest of this half. Ball passes to Nance. Ball outside. Five to shoot. Soft touch off the glass. Ball's got ten. He's finally started to settle down here in the second quarter. Just needed to work up a sweat. On the wing, MP. Stolen by Ball. To the paint. Here's Whitehead. That shot, no good. Good D by Murray. The battle of the boards has been something to watch. MP against Ball. Vassell outside. Clock at four. And the layup is good off the glass. Ten points for him. Comfortable in the second quarter. His efficiency is finally on the rise. The three from Ball knocks down the triple. And the Bulls lead by five. He's looked practically unstoppable this quarter. The defense, yeah, well, they haven't had many answers for him. Outside Murray. Pass to Wallace. Pick by Murray. down the board. Nance has got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Strother. He's guarded by Vassell. Up top, Nance. Pass to Whitehead for three. It doesn't go for him. And even though he hasn't been himself and hasn't affected his team too much, they've still got the lead. You know, not the smartest play a defender can make there. That's his first personal foul. Seven free throw shots for Cobb. So both teams making some changes here. For the Lakers, MV, three shots. And the second free throw is good. <laughs> They've been impeccable from the line here in the second period. Doing what they can to try to build some momentum. And he makes all three. There's a minute 34 left to play in the half. Here's Whitehead. Five points in the game. It's the rebound by MP. With the floater. To the wing, right side. Shot clock at six. It's McDaniels on the wing. The Lakers with another miss. Chicago leading. Pass to Henderson. 50 seconds left in the second. Here's Strawler. McDaniels covering. Out to the wing. Here's Whitehead. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. Whitehead's got seven points in the game. He drops yet another dive. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. MP outside. 23 seconds left in the second quarter. And another shot. It's tipped. And they finally get it to go. A full night's work on the boards and one trip down the floor. He's not just an elite scorer. MP has clamps on D as well. Lonzo Ball 
He's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for Chicago, hitting three trays in the quarter, providing some sharp shooting. And more NBA action on 2K Sports, coming your way right after this. Hello and welcome. First up, folks, let's take a moment to see how things are shaking down in the Rookie of the Year race. So often rookies run out of steam, but not this group. They've had staying power, man. I mean, they're finishing strong. Just like us on 2K Sports. <laughs> and let's take a look back at the first half. The Bulls are in a close one. Well, they're taking care of the ball. That's one thing. It feels like they just want to avoid empty possessions. And for the most part, they have. Like Shaq Shadamas, their advantage is foresight. Mm, we see things others don't. Yama, 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 yama. Thanks for tuning in. Now we head back to Brian Anderson for the start of the third quarter. As we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. And so MP will bring it up for the Lakers. Two-point game. When this game's over, they'll be off to Golden State as they take on the Warriors. And that'll be their only game on the road before heading back home. Murray out there with Miller, then it's MP, then it's Anthony Davis, and it's Wallace in at the two spot. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Pass to Whitehead. Henderson against MP. Just five on the clock, beyond the arc. The rebound by Murray. Murray's got four rebounds in the game. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. MP with it. Henderson picks him up. MP no good. And for those tuning in, we're about a minute into this second half. Inside. And Nance Man. gets it to go on the assist by Henderson. Nance has got six. <laughs> a great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Yeah, taking it right to the ring. One imagines that might be discussed at halftime. That's going to be on the film. Here's Cobb. He's off on the layup. That's not how you want to come out of the break. Three straight misses. They need to settle in quick. Henderson outside. Pass to Whitehead. Covered by MP. Goes up and lays this it in nice two. and easy. Why He's got there? nine. Assertive move. You can tell the game's speeding up a bit. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Timberwolves was outstanding. He contributed 62 points, and he was red hot from beyond the arc, raining down a ton of threes. And the entire NBA talking about his performance. It was that special. Can he do it again? We'll see, guys. Thanks, Allie. Absolutely. He was a one-man show in that one, Grant. Yeah, he was not going to let them lose that game. We'll see if he comes in with that same mentality tonight. And I'll be interested to see if the opposition looks to double him because this should open up opportunities for his teammates to get going. Nance pulls down the board. The Bulls have gotten two of four shots to go since the break. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. He gets Man. it in there. And the Bulls lead by six. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now. Down low. Here's Cobb. MP hammers it down. Such a well-rounded player. MP with his fingerprints just all over this game. MP against Henderson. Foul. foul called on MP. MP. That's his third foul his of the game. Third personal foul. First team foul. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. 
Nance against Davis. To the inside. Here's Strother. And he drops Strother. in the layup off the glass. Strother's got six points. A quality pass setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. Pass to Murray. Here's Wallace. And here's Cobb for three. And it's Chicago with a board. Nance has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. And here's Henderson. Here's Strother. He's got six. Six to shoot. Henderson with it. And Davis picks him up defensively. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. Here's Miller. His offense has been fantastic. Averaging just over 17 a game. He's been a bright spot in their play today, but he can really use some help. The Bulls have gotten five of seven attempts in the third quarter. Henderson against MP. Henderson, the pass to Whitehead. Launches it. Strother, no good. Shocking that he just bricked that one. The defense got real lucky there. Here's Cobb. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his first person. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy passes. MP, two shots. And Cobb drops them both. And here's Henderson. He's got seven. Cobb with the steal. And it's the Lakers on the break. Murray with the jam. You can see the athleticism right there by the young Murray. Just a quality finish. Henderson outside. Here's Whitehead giving them some good production. Putting up just around 16 and a half points a game. Bulls with another miss. Well, he better buy his teammates dinner tonight because they've covered him for what has been a terrible, absolute terrible shooting display. Henderson, the pass to Nance. And Davis with the block. For the tie. MP gets it to go through contact. MP so fierce, going right through him. And here are the Bulls now. Their next game, playing at home as the Grizzlies come to town. And that kicks off a string of three home games for them. Well, Los Angeles shooting 45% here in the second half. Driving to the basket. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Henderson. And taking a broader look here at the year-over-year -year scoring trend for Devin Vassell. And the scoring trend over the last few years has been going down a bit. That's not what you want, and I'm sure it's something he's well aware of. McDaniels is checked in for Murray. Here's MP. Oh, he misses the go-ahead basket. That was a good look for him from mid-range, but just couldn't make the defense pay. To the middle. Here's Nance. Kept alive. Now Los Angeles with it. Good momentum. Eight straight points. Henderson against MP. McDaniels, a screen on Henderson. And he's going for the oop here. Throw it down on the lob. You have to like MP's team first mentality. His playmaking really elevates this offense. Chicago has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Henderson against MP. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. On the wrong side of a scoring run here, we might see a lineup change. I'll, I'll be pretty curious. All right, fans. Here comes your Laker girls.
second for Chicago. The 2K leaderboard highlights the top scorer since the All-Star break. MP number one. You have to appreciate scores who turn it on down the stretch. He's given them points in crucial games. Here's Strother. He has six. There's a screen. Shot clock at six. Drills it from deep. Strother's got nine. A hard-fought matchup. Seven lead changes thus far. And these teams have been sparring from the get-go. Neither able to land the knockout blow. Davis with a screen on ball. Here's Cobb. And that one's long. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. I'm sure they'll think twice about shooting against him next time. And Paul gets it to go. Their defense Three. has to do a better job of smothering those shooters. And so MP will bring it up for Los Angeles. Trailing by four. Pass to Miller. A little mid-range shot is up. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. The assist. MP's got his fourth assist in this one. The ball's knocked loose. Cobb with the steal. Pulls up for three. Here's Davis. And that one's good. With extra effort on the glass. Davis has got his first basket. Look at how competitive Davis gets on the glass. He just knows how valuable those second chance shots are. Pass to Strother. They set the pick. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Jaden McDaniels picks one up. And even from where we're sitting, you can clearly tell it was a foul. Griffin, he's checked in for Nance. And so he hits both. So it's the Lakers now. Two-point game. Here's Wallace. MP outside, Vanderbilt, a screen on ball. Here's Cobb. No good with a jumper from the wing. The Bulls have gotten seven of 14 attempts to fall in the half. Ball against MP. It's stolen. Vanderbilt, a screen on ball. Outside McDaniels. Second chance effort. And the jumper is on the mark. McDaniels got seven. That was a prayer. All luck getting that one to go. Chicago has gone two for five from three since halftime. Ball taking his time here. Brother from deep. Rebounded by the Lakers. Cobb with it. He's got 34. Left side McDaniels. Vanderbilt with a screen. Five on the clock. For the lead. Vanderbilt. Planks the putback jam. And the Bulls shooting about 47% on the third. Whitehead passes to Ball. Griffin with it. And Griffin slams it in. A mistake by the defense. You can't let Ball's teammates get open because he will find them. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. And now that they have some time to get a little bit of rest, it's time for these players to regroup while hydrating themselves with some Gatorade, looking to gain a boost of energy as they continue to play in this game. And staying hydrated is the only surefire way to do it. An athlete's body doesn't have the same power and stamina without proper hydration. These guys will be sure to use this timeout wisely. McDaniels, that's good. And Chicago has possession. Now Griffin. He's got seven. 133 left in the third. 
from the baseline. It's good. And the Bulls lead by two. What an incredible ankle breaker to help create space for a shot. The cell against Ball. Now here's Vassell. Ten points for him. Shoots over Ball. Offensive board. Left side Mitchell. Vassell with the rebound. You gotta move past that one. I mean, they want him to take that again. Yeah, it's a great look for him. One they'll try and manufacture again. Those are the shots you want him to take. He goes up. Oh, now Whoa. that's how you finish a break. Throw it down with force. Oh, that's impactful defense right there. Finding a steal and instantly turning it into offense. Pass to MP. To the left wing. Chicago grabs the miss. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Here's Strawler. Low. And it's in there. Now it's a six-point Chicago lead. But they are in front right now because of him. He keeps draining these shots at a ridiculous clip. Back to Vassell. MP, the pass to McDaniels. And again, the Lakers, no good. With one on the clock. The shot, no good. And so it's the Chicago Bulls with a six-point lead at the close of the quarter. Just pounding. The Bulls, 80. Head coach Billy Donovan is mic'd up along the side. Hold your ground. Don't let him back your way in. Just hold your ground. The other thing, too, is once he picks the ball up, he's not going to shoot it. If he does, just stay down on him. Yeah, coach Donovan. Okay, back. Bang the scout in your port. Substitution here for Chicago. To the paint. Here's Henderson. Well timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. And the Bulls lead by eight. If he wants to make an impact, this is the time. That's only his first bucket in five attempts this quarter. And for Chicago, let's take a look. We've got Henderson, and it's Strother in at the three slot. Miller can't get it to go. Oh, man, that's tough. That's definitely one he'd like back. Almost too wide open. Henderson with it. He's picked up by Vassell. To the inside, Strother. Count it. Strother's got nine points now in the second half. I mean, some good stuff out here. Five of their last six buckets have come off of nice passes. Henderson against MP. Pass to Miller. Takes the three. And it's Chicago with a board. Nance has got rebound number 13 tonight with that one. Here's Strawler. Puts up a three. Nails it. He's now six for eight from the floor. Whatever adjustments were made in half, boy, they are working. He's looking like a different player since the break. Cobb drives in. MP throws it down off the drive. Serving up plenty of intensity on the drive. MP just refusing to be denied. Cobb with a steal. Driving in. No luck on that one. Nice D from Henderson. The Bulls have gotten 8 of 15 during the fourth quarter. And a foul called on MP. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. Keegan Murray's checked in for Vassell. The fourth team foul. Now into the lineup for your Lakers. Number 30, Keegan Murray. Here's Strawler. Down to five on the shot clock. He buries it from three. Strawler's got eight here in this quarter. Something seemed to click for him at halftime. He's looked a lot more focused, and the game is just easy for him now. Pass to Wallace. Over to the wing. Here's Miller. 
and they come right back with their own three-pointer. Didn't get a three in the first half, but now he's on the board with his first triple of the game. That's a key foul. That's his fifth. He's got to be smart the rest of the way. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Bulls. They've been defending with excellent anticipation all game long. Just look at how many times they've managed to get their hands on the ball. Yeah, another thing they did well, running the floor. They've kept the pace high and pulled away with their transition offense. Work in the interior, MP. Some pretty play from MP. Other guys might have backed off because of the contact. Henderson against MP. Out of bounds, it'll be Lakers ball. Lakers ball. Los Angeles has gone two of six so far in the fourth. Here's Miller. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Third team foul. At the line for two, Miller. First free throw is good. Good on both. It's always nice to see a big fella be able to knock down some free throws and make teams pay from the line. MP against Henderson. Pass to Strother. Six on the shot clock. That's the screen from outside the arc. And that one's good. Strother. Strother's got 11 points in the quarter. This defense is getting spaced out. Three of the last five buckets have come from way beyond the arc. Here's MP. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Chicago has gone four of nine from three-point range in the fourth. Murray brings the double. Nance outside. Back to Henderson. Jacks up a three. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Davis has got seven rebounds in the game. He knocked down a three in the first. Another one falls. Amazing. I mean, yet again, he's reached 40 points. He's close to having the fourth most 40-point games in a single year. Well, we've seen it. He's been on fire all season long. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. And you see this so much more nowadays in the NBA. The team's putting a larger emphasis on jacking up threes. Hey, he's doing everything he can to keep them afloat. And for Chicago, they're shooting at a respectable 49%. There's a the screen. Pass to Strother. Three-pointer. Rebounded by the Lakers. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. Great teamwork on that drive. Punctuated by a strong finish. Yeah, that's nice execution. Running with purpose and creating an easy scoring opportunity off the break. And they double up MP. Here's Wallace. And the three off target. Every possession counts for them right now. That's not going to get it done. Counted from distance. And the Bulls lead by 11. And their strategy is obvious. Manufacturer looks from outside the arc. With the way they're shooting, there's no need to look for any other shot. Just keep letting it rain. Chicago shooting 55% since the start of the fourth. And the foul called on MP. That's it for him. He's fouled out. Not only that, we're in the bonus. So we'll go to the line for two. That's a tough walk back to the showers. I'm pretty sure he'd like to have a couple of those plays back. With the depth they have at that spot, they're more equipped than most teams to handle that kind of loss.
No good on that one. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. They're on top by 11. A minute 29 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Look here. Good on the second one. Time running out for the Lakers. Here's Miller. Pass to Wallace. Davis for the screen on Henderson. Here's Wallace. And finished and off by Davis. Davis. And let's not forget about his athleticism. Dominant above the rim. Davis knows how to use his size to his advantage. Both sides are simply waiting for the clock to make it official. This is going to end up in the books as a nice win for the Bulls. And they got a huge boost from their reserves tonight. Yeah, the, the point differential between the two benches was a deciding factor in this game. And they're going to win this one, making this their 47th victory so far. And they fought hard for this win, guys. No one wants to get swept in the season series, even a short one. Man, you have to recognize what a night it was for Lonzo Ball. Oh, he was at the center of everything that happened in this game. His energy was felt throughout the building, and his impact, well, it was incredible. Yep, count it. Robert. And the Bulls lead by 12. Yeah, they blocked out the noise, blocked out the distractions, kept on grinding, and this is their reward. All oh, road wins. They're just so sweet. That They're just so sweet. Right. You know why? Because they are so hard to come by. Just let the clock run out. Hey, it's time to celebrate. And here's Henderson. So the Bulls win it. They have to feel good about this performance. It's one they can be proud of. Very true. I mean, when you're out on the road, the wins can feel a little sweeter. This one has to feel extra special. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. This is Brian Anderson saying thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.